In this tutorial, I will explain what RSSI and SNR are. The Receive Signal Strength Indication, or RSSI, is the receive signal power in milliwatts and is measured in dBm. This value can be used as a measurement of how well a receiver can hear a signal from a sender. In this picture, I have not drawn the sender side, I'm only interested in the receiver side. This is the path loss, the antenna gain, the cable and connector loss, and this is the receive signal strength indication, or RSSI. The receive signal strength indication is measured in dBm and is a negative value. The closer to zero, the better the signal is. Typical LoRa RSSI values are the minimum RSSI value is minus 120 dBm. If the RSSI value is minus 30 dBm, the signal is strong. And if the RSSI value is minus 120 dBm, the signal is weak. The signal to noise ratio, or SNR, is the ratio between the received power signal and the noise floor power level. The noise floor is an area of all unwanted interfering signal sources which can corrupt the transmitted signal and therefore retransmissions will occur. In this picture you will see two situations. In this situation the SNR value is greater than zero, which means the received signal operates above the noise floor. And in this situation the SNR value is smaller than zero, which means the received signal operates below the noise floor. What you now hear is the noise. You can clearly see that the received signal operates above the noise floor. So this is the received signal. Normally the noise floor is the physical limit of sensitivity. However, LoRa works below the noise level. In this picture, this is the noise floor power level, and this is the receive signal strength indication, aka receive power level. And as you can see, the receive power level is below the noise floor power level. Typical LoRa SNR values are between minus 20 dB and plus 10 dB. A value closer to plus 10 dB means the received signal is less corrupted. LoRa can demodulate signals which are minus 7.5 dB to minus 20 dB below the noise floor. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe. If you have questions, leave your comments below. I'll do my best to answer them.